Here we go. Why not? Sure. Tiara's <laughs> breath broke my fight. mind. That's the way.
Huh? Interesting. All right, here goes nothing. to wait. This way, right? To this day, the Shaper's magical and technological prowess remains unrivaled. One thing is clear, none of their marvels would have been possible without an incredible amount of magic. Corporal? Sure. You got it. Well, blow me down with a feather. And here I thought this couldn't get any more impressive. Then I'm guessing we got lucky? This is the Nexus? Yes. We found Mullendeer's heart. <laughs> so, as I said already to Har, if we're to find out anything about the blood burn in this city, it'll be here. Do you see that massive pillar in the center? That's where the Shapers drew their energy from. They used it to communicate, to store knowledge, to power the mechanisms in their city, and to build some of their most magnificent. So this is also some... Well, not in the traditional sense. I doubt you'll find a lot of books here. Huh. And where exactly... Well, that's one of the great Shaper mysteries. There's many theories and few facts. But the most likely one is that it draws from some... If something like that exists, why have I not... As I said, it's just one of many theories. I might be completely mistaken. What did they create? J well, obviously just a few very select items, such as, I suppose, the runes we found. 
Only the most skilled of their craftsmen were allowed to work on that altar you see over there. Being Zaklar, a runesmith, was one of the most respected positions in Shaper society. And only those of the priest caste were even cons- Did you just say they used this place to communicate? Yes. Apparently, some Shapers were able to co- I've heard about that. But what- Well, their telepathy wasn't an innate skill. It was something the higher castes learned through somehow joining their minds to that pillar. They were connected. Well, that does- And a little bit scary. Either way, I suggest we take a look around, see what we can find. Let's see. Nihav's hammer. Do you feel that? Energy. Seems there's still some left. Yeah. And what's that? Could that be where the Shapers forged their creations? That strange rune Lacane gave you. What for? As I said, a little experiment. These shards we found on the ghosts outside. I think I might be able to combine them with our rune. All right. Go ahead. Thank you. Hmm. Huh. Well, that's interesting. What? The runes. They look alike. So, Lacane Might be, yeah. He seemed to think it was a gift from Aeonir. Huh. Interesting. Well, I personally don't believe in Aeonir handing out gifts to his followers, but... So, technically, it could be both... Hmm. And you're still sure you want it? I am. It may take a while, so... Sure. At least we'll be out of the blast radius that way. Very funny. Hmm. Got it. What do we need? Mm hmm. That way? Will do. Now would you look at that? Understood. Got it. Mm-hmm. 
What's that? Hmm. Looks like a map of Fiara. A very old one. So this is what the world looked like during the reign of the Shapers. That's fascinating. Indeed. You see those markings? Glyphs. Hmm. Can you make- I've been trying- Yes! Yes, that's it! Over here, quickly! To this day, the Shaper's magical and technological prowess remains unrivaled. One thing is clear. Is Grim? Ah, there you are! I was right, it worked! Look! I don't see anything. Just take a look! Here, Tar. I- Ah! What the heck just happened? What did you do? I don't know. The rune. It... it must have reacted to you somehow, Tahar. Yes, but why? What did you do to it? I... joined it with the shards we found on the Ghost Watchers. I'm guessing that caused some kind of magical reaction when you, as the rune owner, touched it. So we're bound to the city now? No, of course not. But I think the rune got stronger. Still, I'll have to do more research on this. I can't help but feeling that these runes are an ocean and we've merely touched the surface. Let's just hope there isn't a monster on the bottom. Anyway, what now? We still haven't learned anything new about- That's right, we haven't. But while I was working on the rune, remember how I told you that some of the higher caste shapers were able to con- Frankly, I believe that's ex- You mean we're hearing the thoughts of a sh- The shapers are extinct, so no, but- it might be someone else using Shaper magic or, or, or a sort of mental echo. The memory- I'm not sure what you mean by- Well, the Shapers left all kinds of traces, didn't they? And those specters we fought on the surface are proof that they're ma- Also, we know they use telepathy to communicate, so who knows? Maybe this- Hmm, that's almost poetic. The song is telepathy. You mean- Isn't an actual sound, but a thought trans- Why do we then? Probably because of our magical gifts. So, somebody is talking in our heads. That's bizarre. Be that as it may, how does that get us any closer? Because it tells us what has to be done next. Reactivate the net. Why? Because it might allow us to do the same thing that the Shapers did. Join our minds to that pillar. We could connect to the collective subconscious of an extinct race. Which then again could help us understand the song and its origin. Hmm, that sounds intriguing. How good question. But I believe those two pedestals have something to do with it. I'm pretty sure they're what- And they're empty. So we need to find whatever- Yeah. The only question- Hmm. I think I have an idea. Let's get back to that map. I think Iskrim should take a look at it. Here we go. What do you make of this, Iskrim? A map of old Fiara. By Nehalf, this is... Yes, but I was talking about those markings. They look as though they were added manually, don't they? I... Let me see. Stones of... Wait. You're right. The Stones of the Essence and their location. Stones of the Essence? So they are the power sources we're looking for? They must be, yes. But why would someone hide the stones and then mark their location? Who says someone hid them? Maybe they were just brought somewhere else. It's common knowledge that the last years of the Shapers were chaotic and... Th then maybe it's not a good idea to bring them back, don't... Well, the thing is, without the stones, we're stuck. We need this place up and running to understand the song. Even if my theory about it... Be then we need to find them. Absolutely. And I suggest we start... Hold your horses. We're not getting these stones anytime soon. Why? Because if that map is anywhere near accurate, one of those stones is located in what's now Aeonir's Blade. No point going in there without an army. The Iron Falcons. Right. Iron Falcons? You don't know. The Iron Falcons are an order that is protecting the tomb of Foil Darg. They're fighting the world's end, so to speak. What about the other marking, Iria? Maybe... Hold on. The Field Darg? The Ancient Evil? Yeah, them. According to the lore, the Guardians locked them in this tomb, but the seal has got- I'm surprised you know so little of your own- Well, my father was never interested in old myths. If that's not to say they're a likable bunch. Word has it that they're fanatically religious self- What about the other mark? That one's even worse. This land where the marking- Damn it, you're right. 
but huh, that doesn't necessarily mean that this island doesn't exist anymore. We could build a ship, right? Sail there and find- Yeah, maybe. But again, for that we need support. Someone who can provide us with- in Not to mention the fact, Tahar, that your former general- <sighs> Ideas? Huh. What about that village mayor, Clara Farland? True. And there was a shape- Yeah, though I still don't think this is a good idea. How about the Moorhair Elves? You told me they're investigating the Bloodburn too, didn't you? We fought them in Leonon. I doubt they'll be eager to cooperate. They know they made a mistake. That Scryer, she snapped, and given General Noria's intentions, she wasn't even that wrong to- Alright, it might be worth a try. Well then, sounds like we have plenty of options, doesn't it? Where do we start? Hmm. I think Clara Farlan is our safest bet. She owes us. True. We can still seek out the moor here afterwards anyway. Or the orcs, if you really think this is a good idea. Alright. Then back to Farlan. Yeah. Let's take some more time to rest and get prepared. So, this'll be our base, won't it? I guess so. Yes. Nihalf's hammer. How about a tad more enthusiasm? We're in the ancient city of the Shapers. If anything, we should feel honored. Well, let's just hope the city's defenses work better for us than they did for them. I'll take care of that. Above all, we need allies. We'll find them. What's next? Interesting. So, this is it, isn't it? So it seems. An ancient shaper city on a quest. <laughs> Sounds crazy if you say it like that. In keep? Hey, don't laugh. 
Getting up early in the morning, setting the tables, serving mulled wine and stew to tired, weary souls. Just a simple, honest life. So, you'd leave- Ah, uh, you know. People always act as if these decisions are final. <laughs> Upsides of elven blood. There's plenty of time. Inkeeping is fun, until you find yourself on your knees- Quite the cynic, aren't you? For what it's worth. Sure you do. Who else would patch you up at- Anyway, talk later, shall we? I'm sure you've got battles to prepare. Will do. To this day, the Shaper's magical and technological prowess remains unrivaled. One thing is clear. What's next? Ah, Tahar! How nice of you to come by. Made yourself comfortable? Comfortable? Believe me, just look at this place. A Shaper City. Don't you feel it too? This sense of divinity? You seem to be quite excited. <laughs> what if Tahar, I'm not sure if you understand how much this means. I suppose what I'm trying to say is, thank you. You and the Harbinger have made this dream come true. Well, all we did was save you from the Orcs. You make it sound as if saving me from those green skins anything else I can help you with? If not, I'd like to take another look at that rune Lacan gave us. It's at least as amazing as this place. Will do. Mm hmm. Yes.
Hmm. Yes? Yes. Whatever's necessary. You'll regret 
this. What's next? Get ready! Danger up ahead!
Hmm. Hold on a moment. Do you see that? Yeah. Fresh trails and a lot of them. An army went through here not too long ago. Hmm. Well, let's be on our guard. <gasps> yes? Got it. Blazes. Northander soldiers. Must be your general's men. They followed our trail. Hmm. That was faster than expected. Let's Hold see. it right there. What's your business? We are supposed to meet someone in Farland's Hope. Well, bad luck then. This area is off limits. Now sod off. I could ask you the same thing. What is the Royal Army doing in this place? None of your concern. We're supposed to meet the mayor of this town, Clara Farlan. Where is she? Clara Farlan? What do you want from her? Tahar, don't. We should scout the area first. Um, well, we heard quite some stories about- Of course. Now sod off. Sounds like a plan. Not a single villager in sight. That's ghastly. We should try to find Clara Farlan as soon as possible. If they didn't take her. Now, would you look at that? Sure. Understood. Move along. There's nothing for you people to see here. Interesting. That way? Got it. You got it. Sure. That's the way? Will do. Uh, all right, why not? Sounds like a plan.
That way? This way, right? Move along. There's nothing for you people to see here. Uh-huh. Enough. Let's do this. All right, here goes nothing. I'll keep you shielded. read my mind. Let's see. Sure. Now would you look at that? Interesting. Strange. What is it? I just remembered that I've been here before. I thought this place looked familiar when we first came here. But now I know why. Why? That was six years ago, when the Mage Wars had just started. General Noria... Sintenza... He had made me his squire, so to speak. My father's troops had made a stand in the village. And... Strangely enough, many of the locals were on their side. What happened? Did he order to purge the village, just like he ordered it for Lianen? No, he wasn't that radical back then. We circled the village and threatened the villagers to burn their crops if they didn't turn in the mages they were hiding. They gave in, and not a single person was killed that day.
You got it. Understood. More fighting. Does this never end? Sounds like a plan. Get ready. Here we go. Danger up ahead. All right. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Fine. You regret this. Let's see. That way? Blasted armor. Why not? We'll do. Sure. You got it. Interesting. Now would you look at that? This way, right? Got it. Mm-hmm. Sounds like a plan. I'll keep you shielded. Here goes nothing. We'll 
do. Interesting. Sure. That's the way. Let's see. Sure. Understood. Wrong place, wrong time. That way, friend. Get ready. What do you Whatever's necessary. They will fall. Lord of souls. What a pleasant surprise. Yes? Fair enough. Let's do this. Whatever's necessary. Yes. Interesting. Now would you look at that? <laughs> this is a dream. Ellen's reigns. What happened? Bandits. <laughs> no. No, no, no. Hang in there. What? No. You... You just... help me. What? No! Tiara, grant me hope. No, no, you're wrong. Iria, it's pointless. You have to... But... <sighs> Zerbo, me... Uh -huh. Let's go. And if we find the bastard who did this, I'll have words with him. Wrong place, wrong time. You read my mind. Friend. Yes?
Hmm. Well, that's unexpected. No. You'd like that, wouldn't you? An easy way, but no. That would be too simple. <laughs>